These guys don't let go of the trigger when they're flying, huh? Because quite a few of them, when you kick them, they're still shooting the guns. Oh, yeah. Well, I, I am stunned to learn that trigger discipline among the post-apocalyptic savages is not very good. <laughs> Well, they don't really have time. I mean, like you know, like they're, they're shooting. They think, it, and suddenly they're like, they're suddenly they, okay, wait, why am why am I you know in the air upside down now? They, and then they're dead. Yeah, so they don't really have time. Yeah, I guess. You're just kind of looking for. The way to go. Well, there's a lot of dudes. Oh, did that break? Yeah, some of the stuff here can be can be damaged. I think. That's pretty cool. One of the things I really would have loved to have seen in a bullet storm sequel would be more damageable environments. Yeah. Well, that's something I like to see in games in general, just for more environment physics. Actually, what this I think would be, would be cool would be like an unbroken cityscape. But you can break it to reveal, it like... trashed over the, ga over the game? Well, like, you could yeah. break open the walls and there'd be rebar, and then you could use that rebar. Oh, instead yeah! Instead of the rebar okay. just being laying around. Or, like, yeah, or, like, you wreck something and then there's, like, live wires hanging loose. Yeah. Yeah, that cool. would be cool. I should write... That also could also make for an interesting, like, competitive multiplayer mode, where, like, the stage gradually gets more and more wrecked. Yeah. We should write GDDs. Like... There's like more and more like possible environmental kills. Yeah. We should get into the business, Markley. Just write all the GDDs. I had a great. <laughs> oh there. Oh nice. Uh, that's satisfying. So um, you played Hitman, right? <laughs> oh dang. I I'm sorry. You were saying something. You played Hitman, right? Uh no. You haven't played Hitman. Oh, you should play Hitman. Uh, but a, a couple of the mechanics. Stop, ex stop exposing the depth, the huge gaps in my gaming knowledge <laughs> to the audience, Nick. It's, it's making me look bad. Well, a big mechanic in, in Hitman okay, is um, stealing clothes, like disguises, right? Oh, okay. Right. And uh, so me and uh, Tom and uh, Brett from um, the Sega Addicts podcast. We were just kind of like talking about like ways to make that game non-violent, and we were like, "Yeah, if you take out all the killing, it's just a game where you go around stealing people's clothes." <laughs> and I was like, "I'd actually play that, you know." I just like uh, Pinky. No, well, no, we we envisioned this game where like you're in this world where the the fashion police rule the world, <laughs> and the the poorly dressed are like oppressed. And so you have to like sneak around and find somebody with good clothes and st and like knock them out and take their clothes, but then you have to frame them for like dressing poorly. It was it was like a I can't remember a hit style. That's what we called it, the hit style series. <laughs> and uh, I think I could make money with it. I think I could kickstart this game. <laughs> uh, more, more 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 bad guys coming. There are a lot of... This is a busy station, I guess. Mm -hmm. Which is strange, considering the last train came, like... <laughs> dozens and dozens of years ago. Is that chunks of is that referring to like the shotgun slugs? I just I, I guess I don't I don't, I don't I don't know. Do you do or, except these things are these things are firing shot? I thought. No, no. Oh. It's it's I may be overthinking it. Yeah. Well, see that's the thing like like when everybody refers to all uh, ammo as clips, I know that annoys you deeply. Were well, they all clips or they're all magazines? 
I just jerk awake at night screaming sometimes. <laughs> I can imagine you doing that actually. Just laying there and then just. <sighs> Eyes shooting open. <laughs> Don't even start me about the whole Gatling gun chain gun thing. <laughs> it's the same thing. Helmet. Ow! Kick of Doom. <laughs> Which I believe is just for killing a guy by kicking his own. kicking his balls back at him. That sounds weird. He took his ball and went home. Did you just throw it down? I'm swapping different. Yeah, I'm just oh, okay. Switch, think, of, think about weapons. All right, and off to Disney World. Nice. Actually, this is the kind of train I would I would uh, I really like to ride. There's uh, touristy giant glass pods. I mean, there aren't a whole lot exactly like this. Where Where is Ishi? He's, 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 he's over, to, if I just turn my dad to the right a little bit. Oh, okay. Yeah, I like these. Because they're like... Okay, yeah, we're hearing a little bit more about the situation. There's, there's, there's stuff more dangerous than just these gangs. Just a bunch of aging hippies. But they're really scary. <laughs> Too much brown acid. <laughs> brown acid. Whoa! Uh oh! Did you see that? Yeah. That something jumped a hold of it? Yeah, this is a rough, rough part of town. Indeed. Oh no. Now, these guys, you want to aim for those glowy patches on them. Those are their vulnerable points. Huh. Oh. Man, we oh, spent so, how many vehicles have we crashed in in this game? I don't know. Pretty much all of okay, them. Okay, we we crashed our at, at five chapter. We crashed our spaceship. Right. Then we crashed the train. Right. We crashed the gyrocopter. Right. Um. We crashed the the Godzilla thing. Although we weren't riding, that was we weren't riding. Yeah, that's true. Oh, and then and we kind of then there was the. Uh, that you know that ele that elevate elevator car that we launched at high sp you know at high speed that didn't exactly crash because it was fired but it was a crash in spirit I think. <laughs> now, did you count the dam? Would you count the dam as? Cause... The dam is it's sort of borderline because yeah we were on that platform that kind of fell off. It was a again a crash in a vehicle crash in spirit. We've crashed on, like, everything except the traditional video game crash of, you know, the helicopter. I thought you were going to talk about the video game crash of 83. <laughs> yes, the... Yeah. Grace and Ishii and Trishka, they've crashed disastrously against the blood of low-quality of low quality software for the Atari. <laughs> yeah, now these guys, you want to shoot them in those glowy areas, but they're still vulnerable to environmental stuff. Nice. I was so happy when they found that landfill. Oh, with the ET car? Yeah. Also, notice all that stuff stuff they leave behind instead of blood. It's like lava. They, they, they design into... They dissolve into powdered tang. Mm. Why do I... Why do I keep referencing tang? I don't know, you've got point? tang on the mind. I think you... I, I haven't consumed Tang in decades. <laughs> in decades. That... No, it's, I haven't. And I don't remember particularly enjoying it when I did, so... My my dad um, tried Tang because uh, the, uh -oh. the soldiers would give it out during the war. Really? Yeah. And uh, he tried to replicate the effect by um, boiling orange peels. No. 
but you know he was a poor Vietnamese. Well, he 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 worked with what he had. Yeah. But uh, and then he remembered he he'd come to America and he'd be like, it's just it's just in bottles here, you just buy big ass containers of it. It's awesome. Okay, now here's... I run into a bit of an issue here, as I recall. There's some sort of... I, bought, I buy weapons, but there's some sort of glitch where I couldn't access them, or the ammo or something. You'll see, you'll see what I mean. Yeah. <clears throat> now, you gotta go it alone here for a bit, because... You gotta, like, basically the door's kind of... why I did that. The door's kind of stuck, basically stuck, you need to slide under and then open it from within. Mm. But fur, but... uh-oh. You're not alone. I, I keep trying to use the bolo here, which... It's really, the bolo is really much better for, like, open outdoor environments than something like this, to be honest. Yeah. Lots of places for it to get trapped on. Oh, yeah, you can destroy the statues. Oh. Are they just of giant naked ladies? They appear to be. Oh, also, uh-oh. It's a trap. So, it's, it's never a good sign when someone is writing messages in blood. <laughs> what what's the line from Monty Python? The castle of uh... a pe some of 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 something peril. Yeah. Or wait. I know what you're talking about. It's just, <laughs> yeah. it's, it's just eluding me. It's been forever since I've seen that movie. Ah, some boot air, some a nice swigger, something. Okay, now this really. Why? Now that we've had the point system explained to us, why is the military encouraging <laughs> its elite troops to see, like, to kill while drunk? Consume alcohol <laughs> on the battlefield. Oh, down I go. But yeah, that seems really. Well, there's that really just seems like asking for trouble. There's the other one where you get poisoned and then kill. <laughs> Oh yeah! Kill yes, yeah, get kills while hopped up on green rage spores. Encourage it. If you don't, someone else will. It's like that it's like that we like that weird military L S D research they did in the sixties. <laughs> yeah. Uh It's like a haze. <laughs> I'm glad I'm not the only person on Earth who actually remembers Hayes. <laughs> one thing I will give Hayes, it is one of the only console shooters I've ever played where all the keys are, all, or all the buttons are fully remappable. That's true, yeah. Which was really neat, and I don't know how the game, how that game, of all things, got that right, and no, virtually no one else has or has. I think it was very hard to do. If I remember right, everything else about the game was just kind of meh. Yeah, the game it was it was pretty it was mediocre. Yeah, like it wasn't bad, but it was like it was yeah well yeah it was it was yeah it wasn't terrible or anything, it's, but yeah it wasn't particularly but which is unfortunate because the premise was sort of interesting. Yeah, and I wish they'd done done more with it. Well, I can't remember who, but somebody talks about um, like doing different things with the game, like. Uh, you know, when you're with the Marines, just, like, having all-out assault tactics versus when you're teamed up with the uh, guerrillas, you should, like, be more sneaky. But they don't do anything like that. No, it, it, they don't really. It's too bad.